up guys? So today we're gonna be unboxing uh, Prada. No, we're gonna be unboxing B Coffee. So this is it. It's a coffee machine. It's kind of like the uh, Nescafe Dolce something and then Nespresso. So I have the Nespresso. We'll do a quick comparison uh, later. I'll, I'll put a link in the video. So um, I ordered a couple of things. So this is their Freshman, this is their entry level um, coffee machine. So I ordered. They have also. They have a bunch of syrups. Um, so I ordered three. I think they have four or five flavors. So I, I forgot. But yeah. So this is. I got the caramel for caramel macchiato. I got vanilla and also chocolate, just in case the uh, espresso is too strong. So I got these. And I also ordered a couple of pods. I got the mocha, I got a dulce, and a cappuccino. These are around 250 to 250 something, all right? Um, I forgot the details. So compared to an espresso, an espresso costs around, this is 10 pods, right? 10? Yeah, so yeah, so 10 pots in an espresso would cost around 400 to 500 pesos. So, huge price difference. And that's kind of like gonna be one of the comparison. And I also got, so these are free, I guess, because I didn't order these. I got the uh, it's Cafe Essential Discovery Series. And a frother. So, this Prezzo doesn't have this, they have the the whole container itself and also the one I have is the uh, Nespresso Atelier it has its own frother on incorporated in the machine itself and here we go we have the wait I gotta I'll take it out few moments later finally I got it out all right so this is their uh, B coffee refreshment and this is their entry-level uh, coffee machine compared to Nespresso mini I used to have one of those I just sold it this cost around 4,000 something and the more or less Nespresso costs around 9,000 or 8,500 the price is there's a huge difference and later on we're gonna test it I'm gonna test it out see if it's good but so it comes with the manual um, I don't know you know me I don't read manuals so yeah, let's go ahead and open it up and I got the pink version <laughs> because <laughs> this is like their last talk of for it because I already have everything in my house is black so the is black house black everything's black so, something, yeah, color for a change. Here we go, let's open it up. Let's see how it is. Ah, oh, that looks nice. All right. Okay, so, we have everything out of the box. I guess this is, um, this is a strainer. Um, and this is, I don't know what this is guys. Oh, this is for the cover here. Oh, nice, so you can put pods here and like your little cups. Nice, that looks, that's sweet. All right, so you put it here. All right guys, so my dog's here here. Um, there's three buttons over here, if you guys can see. It's the Resetto, Espresso, and Longo. So there's three buttons, so it's gonna be automatically set when you do your um, coffee. I don't know if you can reprogram it. I'll have to check uh, the manual, I guess, because I know in the Nespresso, you can reprogram it and how how long you, I, you'll just press and hold and then it'll automatically adjust. So it's probably gonna do the same thing. And this holds a good amount of water. I'd say 500, estimately, 500-ish. So, all right. Let's go ahead and check it out. Let's go ahead and test it. Uh, 
compare it against my Nespresso. I'll make two. Oh, also guys, this makes the same. You guys can use this in your Nespresso machine and vice versa, I'm assuming. So I'll go ahead and make the same cup of coffee with this. So Nespresso and this together and see what tastes better. And if this tastes better, I'll probably sell my Nespresso. Cause that's like 30,000 compared to 4,000 pesos. So let's go to check it out. All right guys, so we have <clears throat> the Nespresso and the beef coffee. So what we'll do is we'll try out their Marco Pod and see which machine makes the better coffee. So I'm gonna put it right up here, over here. Okay, so we have the pods in place. We got the pods inside. So new machine, make sure you have you put in the uh, like at least what I do it is I clean it, I put the whole, I fill the whole tank and then just pour water in so that way it's super clean. So we'll, we'll go ahead and I'm gonna try the Nespresso, uh, the, the Espresso on both of them and see what tastes better. So I got the mocha on both. Let's see. I'll do, we'll do a quick test. I'm gonna be honest, see what tastes better. And, all right, it's done. I'm going to test it right now. All right guys, welcome back. So I tasted both of them, and to be honest, there's not really any any difference at all. Um, so I guess it just really depends on what pods you're gonna be using. So does it make sense to buy an espresso machine, like an expensive one, compared to, to this? Um, really, it, it doesn't make sense. So I, if I'd known about B Coffee, I would've just bought one of their machines instead of, instead of this. So that's it guys, thank you for watching. Um, check out their site, I'm gonna put a link on the, uh, below to, so you can see their products. And buy an espresso. Peace out.